Countries around the world are committed to act on climate change because the need to act in a way that is globally effective is urgent and real. That is why countries have committed to ambitious targets. For different circumstances, there are different approaches to reduce emissions. But to achieve our common global objective of net zero emissions, we need to work together. We need to share data and information about what we're all doing to bring emissions down. We need to learn from each other. And we need to discuss how we can best optimize the global impact of our individual efforts. パリ協定の 1.5 度目標を達成するためには各国の社会経済システムをクリーンエネルギー中心へと変革し排出削減と経済成長を両立するグリーントランスフォーメーションを実現していかなければなりません。No nation can tackle climate change alone. We all have a shared responsibility to implement ambitious emissions reduction measures. And these measures work best when we do it together. Sharing data, exchanging best practices, and coordinating efforts. In order to deliver on the Paris Agreement, we need to coordinate our efforts globally and not just shift emissions from one part of the world to another. Progress starts with a close look at reality. We need a better understanding of where we are in terms of numbers and climate policy measurements. International cooperation is key for the success in delivering global public goods, such as climate change. It will complement and strengthen national effort by building global enabling environment and also having a fair burden sharing across countries. Global collaboration is key to ensure a successful transition to a low carbon economy while maintaining fair and open trade. Pour lutter contre le réchauffement climatique, il est impossible d'agir chacun de son côté. C'est courir le risque de superposer des politiques nationales inadaptées, divergentes, voire nocives pour les autres États. Et c'est favoriser la division et la rivalité. Our success depends on coordinated plans and concerted actions. Such plans and actions require a mutual understanding of the different situations and priorities of each country and region. That is why we believe sharing knowledge, experiences and lessons is critical. And we must work together. And we can also learn from one another. The launch of the OECD's inclusive forum on carbon mitigation approaches can be an important step in this direction as a platform to exchange information, share best practices, and coordinate our efforts. Meeting our climate goals requires both effective multilateral coordination and rigorous technical analysis. We welcome the OECD leading this deep technological and methodological research. The inclusive forum on carbon mitigation approaches will facilitate data and information sharing on emissions reduction policies. It will facilitate evidence-based mutual learning and it will provide an inclusive platform for multilateral dialogue. It is designed to help optimize the global impact of individual countries' efforts to reduce emissions. Cette coopération, elle doit avoir une ambition la plus forte possible. Nous devons favoriser la mise en œuvre de politiques ambitieuses pour l'atténuation des émissions de carbone, c'est-à-dire des politiques massives pour atteindre les cibles que nous nous sommes fixées à Paris il y a presque sept ans, la neutralité carbone en 2050 et le maintien de l'augmentation de la température en dessous de 2 degrés. Il faut mobiliser le maximum d'investissements publics et d'investissements privés vers la transition écologique 
pour tenir ces objectifs ambitieux. Having a multilaterally agreed objective assessment of decarbonisation policies will help all of us make informed decisions on how best to work together to achieve global net zero. This is a whole of society effort. Success rests on a toolbox of different measures and approaches. And carbon pricing has proved to be a key tool to drive down emissions. Every country will have different approaches to reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Therefore, we must take steps to enhance the transparency and understand the efficacy of different policy approaches. This new forum will play a significant role as a venue for policy dialogue and information sharing in particular by setting up a comprehensive mitigation policy database and facilitating cost-effectiveness analysis of such policies. I do hope that the IFCMA can develop into a trusted and inclusive platform for dialogue as well as sharing information among countries, as well as making sure that our action contribute to the overall mission of reducing global emission. Together, we can address and overcome the climate change challenge. Enfin, notre efficacité, elle dépendra aussi, en termes de réduction des émissions de CO2, de nos choix économiques, de nos capacités à concilier climat et prospérité, lutte contre le réchauffement climatique, et maintien d'ambition en termes de prospérité collective. IFCMA には気候変動対策についてのデータや試験の共有を通じて早期のネットゼロ目標の達成に向けて各国の努力を後押しするような成果を期待しています。The climate challenge before us is urgent. We need to act, and we also need to get it right. The launch of this forum will help us do just that. I look forward to working with all of you to accelerate progress on our ambitious climate goals. We need platforms for dialogue and for sharing experiences, platforms like the one you're kickstarting today. What your work can contribute to our international discussions at the political level are tangible and widely accepted results on the effectiveness of different price-based and non-price-based mitigation policies. This will lay the groundwork for us as decision makers to choose the most suitable policies. Addressing climate change effectively and efficiently is a truly global challenge which requires global coordination. This initiative brings countries together on an inclusive basis and on an equal footing. Together, we will take stock and consider the effectiveness of all the different carbon mitigation approaches in close coordination with other international organizations. At the OECD, we will build on our track record of providing data and statistics measurement frameworks and evidence-based analysis and are fostering multilateral dialogue worldwide. Better data and information sharing, a truly inclusive dialogue. And working together is what will help us achieve our global net zero emissions objective. <laughs>